For nearly 150 years, Meharry Medical College has been a go-to HBCU for aspiring black healthcare professionals. And on this first day of Black History Month, our Hannah McDonald tells us about a new exhibit recognizing the college's story past. I don't know of any other institution, I've worked at several HBCUs, that have saved as much as Meharry. We kept photographs, thousands of photographs. These cases that look more like time capsules hold Meharry Medical College history. These are Meharry instruments that were used in the 1920s. That type of history reaches out to uh, students, to researchers. Sandra Parham is the executive director of the library at the college. We have the letter that he wrote to get into Meharry. We have his first ID card. She designed this display at the Tennessee State Library and Archives, which will be up throughout Black History Month. There should be no reason that we have someone, a child who goes to middle school or elementary school that doesn't know that you have an HBCU hospital that was started in 1876 for enslaved people that have come this far. Getting Meharry's story out to the public actually started with this book. All of the photos in this exhibit come from this book. Uncle Sam, we say, enrolled every Meharry student in World War I and World War II. We have the pictures over there, and it looks like did the whole class put on a uniform? The whole class put on a uniform. You could say the college was actually built to serve. This is a panoramic view of the school in 1924. It was created because Nashville needed more doctors and nurses. Things like cholera and diphtheria and smallpox was just running amok. And these days, Meharry is on the front lines again. Most of us know Meharry and Dr. Hildreth just based on all of our COVID activities activities and service to the community. Help people learn a little more about a college that's made a big difference. That is the goal. The stories are remarkable. I always say it's the substance movies are made of. Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5.